Yeah, um, I use a lot of visual visualization ta- tactics, um, especially leading up to the game. Not so much in the week of training. Um, I do get into some form of meditation. We do a little bit of yoga, which comes with meditation. Um, that's just to kind of keep me grounded, I guess, more than anything. Um, but visualization is uh, probably one of the biggest tactics I use leading up to a game. Um, I'll even sometimes watch a highlight video of myself uh, of doing things good that I know, um, you know, that, that I know I can do before a game, uh, just to get my confidence higher um, leading up to a game. But the biggest thing is um, being prepared for the game. Uh, I believe that a week of training, um, if you've prepared the way you should, everything should take care of itself. So um, before the game, as I, we're walking out to the national anthem, I always talk to myself and say, "You prepared. You've done everything right." Um, you're going to score a goal and not let any goals in. And I say that before every game. Visualizing everything positive. So you don't want to bring in any negative uh, images into your mind. I do a lot of, I'm a center back, so I do a lot of receiving the ball, with preparing with one touch, playing it to my outside back or center midfielder. Um, something simple like that. Just simple visualization tactics or um, stepping in front of a player uh, when a ball's coming into a forward and I can receive it. I take it away from them and then play the simple pass. Um, really sound, small um, tidbits of visualizing just to get me um, in a positive mindset before a game. Mike just have won the first game in 2016 for Jurgen Klinsmann.